What's up everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm here with my friend Len and we have his 2013 STI and today we're going to be doing um, side skirts and his diffuser. Yeah, my name's Len. Uh, Roman's helping me out with my 2013 STI airbag suspension, rotiform wheels, Cobb Stage 2 tune. Uh, we're going to install these, what are they, aluminum, plastic, whatever, something like that. Like plastic aluminum side skirts off of eBay actually for, these are 125 and a matching rear diffuser and that's aluminum i think that one was about 275. Uh, he'll post the link down below uh, so then you guys can check it out so here you guys got the uh, rear diffuser as len said it was uh, from strafe design and it looks pretty similar to my cars um evil subi custom is just a little shorter but there are the aggressive type with the nice little big fins up back there so first we're going to do the side skirts first. Um, we already got the car jacked up, and uh, we'll go to do the side skirts. All right. So as Lance said, the side skirts are like uh, it's like two pieces of aluminum squished in between a plastic. Um, they're basically the same material as my front uh, my front splitter also. All right. So the side skirt doesn't come with uh, holes, so you gotta line it up with your side skirts. And it comes came with uh, self-tapping screws and some washers. So what we're going to do is basically we're gonna set it up how we want it to set it up, which is around right around something like that. And then we'll just tap here in the front, and I'm gonna tap it all the way to the back, and then uh, we'll go from there. <laughs> side skirt is complete it's uh it's like the simplest thing that we can do here it's really easy basically we put this nice and flush right here put one of the drill one of the screws here also at the end and then basically screw 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 on the on the bottom and it's nice and sturdy and it's pretty pretty good no gap uh that we could see except down there we probably will put one more screw there just to close that tiny little bit of a gap and then that's it and then we're gonna move to the other side do that really quick and then be done with the side skirts okay. trying to make it look nice for the video yeah we look fucking half decent yeah, right? <laughs> it's like fucking garbage get you on camera wiping down clean baby just don't look above that <laughs> All right, so we're done with the uh, both sides of the side skirts for the STI. You guys can see that's um, that's basically the one side. It's nice and wide, and it's nice and nice and stiff there. Let me show you guys the other side. And that's the other side right there. It's looking pretty pretty badass looking. Um, Len's gonna take the Mutt flats out. Uh, it's really not really just touching this little tiny little bit piece right here. Uh, Hoochie, he already took the other parts out, but when he airs out, uh, this mutt flat does touch the floor, so he just wants to take those out. So, on to the rear diffuser. Rear diffuser is there, it's basically three pieces. You got the middle piece right here, you got the side pieces. Uh, so we were trying to test fit the side pieces, but there was a problem because he got these cover fiber What do they call exhaust? Exhaust little cover so with these piece with that little cover fiber thing These pieces didn't really uh, line up with the bumper. They were not flush and I am on focus there we go. So with that carbon fiber thing the piece didn't really was flush with the um with the bumper so we had to take the carbon fiber things off and we clean up a little bit because there was a little glue stuff like that so this is where we're at right now uh, also so part of uh, doing the sides 
right here there's there was two clips underneath which we took off and also I need to use a half an inch drill bit but my drill does not fit in there so I actually did it with my hand and I was able to shave off some of the hole and to be able to fit this little rubber piece which goes right there there we go and then that's uh that's how we're gonna do the sides we're gonna start with the sides first I'm gonna do this by hand and then um because my of course my drill doesn't fit this it's huge and then we'll go do the sides first and then we're gonna go tackle the middle so I got this one the problem with this one is I gotta do this like an inner this inner part right here Get it, with my hand. Hand drilling right I here. Got it. I think I got it. There we go. It's a little painful, but. them both. Use this, a little bit of this, these. And this is... Alright, I think we just ran into a problem here because Look how this look at this fitment. So that's the correct side, isn't it? That's yeah. It's in the I think it's in the holes. And the holes are lined up. Yeah. But it's like like this. That's what the fuck? Not how it's supposed to be. <laughs> Unless it sends you the wrong part though. I mean the middle looks correct. Just the sides don't look correct though. I'm gonna have to do some research. <laughs> we'll figure this out because this is just this is just off, man. All right, so we figured this out. It pretty much angles in, right, Angel? Kind of, it's yeah. not flush. Yeah, it's not supposed to be flush. Um, according to the pictures we were looking, it kind of angles in, so it's not straight down. Uh, right now we're trying to get this little pressure rubber thing to kind of see if we can tie it up without it popping it out. And I think, yeah, there we go. Yeah, that's the type. yeah, it's tight there. So I think it goes somewhere around right there. So it's not really flush the middle part it it is kind of flush with it but this side part it kind of angles angles in what do you think yeah i think i mean you gotta do what you gotta do i mean yeah. that's how it's supposed to be looking but it is yeah i mean compared to angels i'm gonna, actually i'm gonna look at you real quick see i look at angels his is like pretty flush or pretty straight that's what i'm talking about because the bottom of his his bumper is flat with with my gr i think he's gr there's like a there's like a bump um i mean we're also be happy with it but he got the evil subi customs and i got the ebay strafe design all right so we figured out what the problem was uh so we did this side this side that len is doing right now we actually did it in the holes aligned uh, correctly and the little side diffuser was actually kind of flush sideways so is that the holes on this one were incorrectly done um, we actually got the top hole done but the bottom hole the hole closest to this side is way too close to the corner so it kind of angled it 
in the wrong direction. You can kind of see the hole right here. That hole's right there. That's the hole right there. So we remade like some holes. Let me see you can see that. We remade a hole next to the big hole and kind of align it nice and straight. So the only problem is that these holes were like too close to the edge or something. Um, that's the that was the only problem we had there. So we're trying to make all these nice and flush over there. He's gonna he's checking how it looks, and then um, because it's not entirely perfect right here, and then this one is more flush over here. So it's not entirely perfect, but we're uh, double checking how it looks. See if we can adjust something. All right, so we got the both sides are all done. They're basically the same. We got it. We can't. We could have kind of shift a little bit. So they're both um, pretty good there. That's a little side profile. And then now we're gonna do the middle part, which we already kind of uh, drew some hole. Well, drew some little dots around there. Now you. Can't even see it anymore. It's it's somewhere down there. Um, and I'm gonna drill some holes now, and then uh, then we're gonna put bolt it all up together, and we're almost done. Alright, so the holes are done, and all we're doing right now is just tying it up. We got the uh, two screws in the back that actually tap into like the uh, spare tire well. Um, those are nice and tight. The sides are tight, and now we tighten up the middle part of it, and that's gonna be it. They'll be done. All done. Check it out. Nice little quick little diffuser right there. And um, yeah, it's not bad. It's uh, we still gotta do a little bit, you know, work on the other, the little side part of the diffuser. Took us a while to figure it out, but we got it all done. All right, so this is a uh, car on the ground. You guys can see the uh, rear diffuser it's pretty low, close to the ground. Um, it seems a little closer to the ground than mine. Uh, so now what we're gonna do is gonna take the cars out, both my car, his car. It's, it is raining, but uh, we need to get some cool shots. So let's get on it.
that's it for uh, today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed that little uh, quick little roller shots that I've done. It's my ever first ever uh, attempt to do a couple of roller shots with uh, anybody's car. So um, yeah, what you got? What you think about the uh, side skirts and the rear diffuser? Yeah, they're. I mean, they're good quality and everything. The uh, we ran into a little problem with the actual manufacturer with the holes being offset wrong. Um, but Angel made it work, uh, and it looks way better now because originally it was like freaking jacked up man it was like sideways but it looks good now man it looks really good and on the way down it's freaking actually hit the end of the driveway and his driveway is just a little bit angled um but other than that like the rolling shot thing was cool too man that's the first time he did it uh, i had to set up with the walkie talkie but those things are hard man don't don't knock on those those people when they do that stuff they, they put in some work so respect to angel for doing that um, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video because I, I had fun and uh, we'll be back again too. I'm gonna leave the links for the side skirts and the diffuser on the description below. Uh, they're from eBay. How much they cost again? The side skirt was 125 shipped. Uh, came in about like 10 days, and then the uh, the rear diffuser had to been like I think it was 275. So they're they're very on the low end, and the quality is good. So you know. Yeah, I did like those side skirts. I'm thinking of actually getting the side skirts for myself. I got those other cheap ebay side skirts but i'm really i'm really digging those side skirts it looks more aggressive and it's a little wider that's pretty much it that's all for you guys today i see you guys in the next one just remember to like and subscribe and see you on the next one